Hi folks, nice from HanaAndroid.com, where we get hot on Android every day. I know the other day I showed you the Android 5.0 Lollipop, and uh, you know if you don't have a Nexus 5 or Nexus 7 2013 edition, um, you can't try the latest Android 5.0. Uh, but you can get the Android 5.0 keyboard right now on any Android device. Um, I've got it running on my Note 4, uh, and you don't need root. And let me show you how to do this, it's really easy. Let's go do this, baby. Hi folks, so let me go ahead and show you how to install Lollipop keyboard on any Android device. You do not need root. Um, this will work on most Android devices. I probably won't hurt to try. Um, so first you'll need to download the APK file. Uh, I've made a short, short link so you guys can find it easier if you want to follow along uh, with the video. Or you can go ahead and uh, uh, follow the download link on my site if you want to make it. Um, go to bit.ly, B-I-T dot L-Y slash uh, and type lollipop keyboard, lollipop uh, keyboard like that. And this will direct you directly to the download link of the lollipop keyboard. Um, this is actually done by XDA user uh, Shaft Aim, Shaft, uh, Shaftam, Shaftam. Uh, anyway, don't forget to donate to him because he actually modified the APK files uh, to make it happen. Um, go ahead and hit the download link at the bottom and go ahead and uh, download the APK file and go ahead and hit OK um, if it says it's harmful it's not harmful and once downloaded you simply open the APK file install it that's pretty much it and let me go ahead and open it here um, sometimes on some de devices you might get uh, cannot open the file uh, what you can do is go ahead and use uh, My Files app if you're using a Galaxy device, uh, or you can download ES File Explorer app, uh, your, or your favorite File Explorer app, um, app, and go ahead and go into your download folder. You should be able to find the APK file there, there also. Uh, if you get install blocked, uh, make sure you hit unknown sources on, and, and then try to reinstall it. And I'm going to go ahead and install it. And here we go. And go ahead and open the Lollipop keyboard. Um, go through the setting here. Um, you can go ahead and enable Lollipop keyboard. Hit OK. Switch input methods. Change it to uh, Lollipop. And you should have Lollipop keyboard now. And let's try it. But you don't get the light material theme, so you have to change the theme also. Um, so go back into settings. Go back into uh, language and inputs, and go back into the settings of Lollipop keyboard, and go ahead and change the appearance and layouts. And you can go ahead and change that theme to material light or material dark. Um, and that will give you the latest Lollipop keyboard, uh, which is great. Ah, all right, <laughs> there we go. Um, very good stuff, and this one works flawless. This is, I believe, it's stri uh, pulled straight from a uh, the Android 5.0. Um, so looking very good. Um, so definitely check it out um, if you want Lollipop keyboard. You can get it now. Again, thanks to XDA user Shaft Tamali. I don't know how to say it, but uh, don't forget to donate to the guy. Uh, I'll have the link to the credit section on my site. Um, and uh, enjoy your lollipop keyboard. That's pretty much it. And thanks guys for watching this video. If you like this video, as always, don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and as always, stay on Android.